Hey what is up guys welcome to another Clash Royale video and in this video I'm going to be doing some more battles with my level 1 account and we're up against a level 8 so let's begin so I'm gonna go with the Valk in the back okay he's got a royal giant so I'm gonna save my inferno dragon for the royal giant and I'll back up the Valk with a giant skeleton and now I'm gonna use inferno dragon here since he used his minions uh, minion horde on the right side so now the ice wizard should be able to get rid of all these skeletons and minions and now the inferno dragon is gonna get some damage uh, yeah it got a little bit of damage on that tower and I managed to get him to waste his zap so that was a pretty good start and uh, now I'm gonna go with a tombstone here in the center and I'm gonna go Valk in the back again It's weird how he's playing the Royal Giant in the back. I mean, he should play it at the bridge because uh, that's the reason why a Royal Giant is considered OP, right? Uh, if it if it's played at the back, then oh my God, he's gonna use. Oh, whoa! I I was expecting him to use a Minion Lord on the Inferno Dragon, but that did not happen. So that was good for me. And now I have to get rid of this minion horde and the witch is going to get taken out by the inferno dragon. That's pretty good. Uh, one fire spirit is going to get a hit. So my tower ended up taking a lot of damage. But I managed to do some damage to his tower as well. And I'm going to go with another tombstone in the center once I hit 9 elixir. And I'm gonna go uh, Ice Wizard here in the back. Oh my god, he's playing the Royal Giant there. I'm gonna use Skeleton Army to counter the Royal Giant. And let's see what he does. Oh, he, oh I forgot about Zap. I forgot that he had Zap. I'm gonna use Roy, uh, Roy, uh, the Giant Skeleton on this left lane. And now I'm gonna use Valk to counter the Witch. Oh, the Witch is gonna get taken out by the bomb. That's pretty good. And now I'm gonna go... Oh! Okay, he's got another Royal Giant. I'm going to use a Tombstone here to distract the Royal Giant again. And I'm going to go opposite lane with the Inferno Dragon. So hopefully... Oh my god, no, 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 no. No, no. Okay. Okay, Royal Giant got taken out. Oh my god. No, please, please, please. Off. Okay, I, I just lost this game. I just lost this game. And maybe my Inferno Dragon could have won, but I was late on that fireball, so it did not hit the minions, and I ended up losing. Uh, okay, so let's get into another battle. And we're up against a level 8 again. And this time I'm going to start off with a tombstone here in the center. So my opponent is going to go wizard in the back and I'm going to go giant skeleton in the back. And I'm probably going to use the Valk at the bridge to counter the wizard. Oh he's got, oh he's going to mirror minions so that's a good fireball. And now this minion is going to get taken out by the tower and the wizard is going to get taken out by the giant skeleton. If he uses skeleton army, oh he's got elite barbs. So I'm going to slow down the elite barbs using my ice wizard so that they get taken out by the bomb. Hopefully. Nope one elite barb got saved and now I'm going to put my Valk in, in between so that the elite barb retargets onto the Valk and now I'm going to go with another tombstone in the center so the tombstone skeleton should cancel out the fire spirits if I'm not wrong and I'm going to use my giant skeleton here to tank shots from the musket uh, from the minions oh he's got skeleton army I'm gonna log maybe I should have used the log a little bit in front so that it would get some damage on the tower as well but anyways now I'm gonna use my ice wizard here to slow down the fire spirits and I'm gonna use Valk as well
Okay, he's gonna go with another furnace. I can fireball, but I don't want a fireball, so I'm gonna go with a tombstone. Oh, okay, he's got a lead barb, so I'm gonna have to use skeleton armor here. And I'm gonna use tombstone as well, and I'm gonna log at the same time. So the elite bars are still gonna get a lot of damage on that right tower. Now I guess I'll go, yeah, I'm gonna go giant skeleton here, I'm gonna go inferno dragon opposite lane. So let's see what he does about the inferno dragon, he's probably gonna use, oh, he's gonna use fire spirits. I was expecting minions, but he used fire spirits, which are also good against the uh, inferno dragon. And I'm gonna go tombstone in the center, he's probably gonna use minions now to counter the tombstone. There you go, so I'm gonna fireball the elite barbs and the minions. And, oh, he's gonna rush me at fire spirits, I mean, the fire spirits are gonna hit my tombstone skeleton, so I have to do something about the elite barbs. So I decided to defend with a Valk, and now, it looks like I'm in some serious trouble here. I'm gonna go... He's probably gonna use skeleton army. Oh my god. No, don't, don't, don't. Okay, but we're not gonna win this. We're definitely not winning this. I'm not sure if he has direct damage. If he does not have direct damage, then maybe we still have a chance to draw the game. Uh, but, let's see. I'm gonna go Ice Wizard here, and boom, I'm gonna use Skeleton Army to counter the Elite Bugs, and I'm gonna use uh, Tombstone here as well, to slow them down, and now I'm gonna Fireball the Minion Horde and the Fire Spirits, that was a pretty good Fireball there, managed to shut down almost everything, oh, so we can draw this game if, uh, if we manage to defend for 5 seconds, which I think we will, and there you go, wow. We were about to lose this game, but I ended up drawing the game, which was pretty awesome. So I guess that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed watching the video. Thanks for watching, and see you guys in the next video.